morning. Just come downstairs, all showered. Morning, birthday girl. Morning. Thank you. Oh, I got birthday cards. Yeah, today is Friday the 18th of December and it is my... Should I say how... What number? You just shone. Oh. <laughs> my 33rd birthday. This lighting is terrible. It makes me look 53. <laughs> it's my 33rd birthday. I'm quite puffy eyed and I've not long got up, but it's my birthday. And... We're going somewhere, aren't we, Carl? Yep. We but are. I don't know where, so he's told me I have to pack a bag for the night. Far, far away. <laughs> um, but I don't know where we're going. So it's quarter, nearly quarter to nine now. You said we've got to leave by about 11? Yeah, 11-ish. So, nice chilled morning. I'm gonna make me some crumpets. Open and my juice. And a juice. What juice, orange or green? Orange. Orange. Orange is my favourite. It's sweeter. And um, it's got carrots, ginger and apple in it. Um, so yeah, I'm going to have that, get ready and then go on our travels and see where we're going. I'm excited. Um, but yeah, I'm going to take you along with us for the day or as much of the day as I can. It's quite gloomy outside and raining. I don't know if you can see. It's a bit wet, but it's not going to dampen our spirits today, is it, Carl? What's that, sorry? It says it's gloomy and wet outside, but it's not going to dampen no, our spirits today. No, it should be good. So, yeah, come along with us to see what he has in store. Right. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Thanks! <laughs> These are from my mum and dad. Aren't they? Look at this. I'll open my cards first. So, open the red one with my age on it. I know who this is from though, it's from my grandma. Granddaughter, treat yourself to a fabulous day. You so deserve it. Happy birthday, Charlotte, with all our love from grandma and granddad. Aww. Oh, and they put a check in my card. Oh, yeah, thanks, Grandma and Granddad. Miss you. <laughs> From my mum and dad. <laughs> Sorry, Dad. <laughs> but I know mum's got it. <laughs> Daughter, whatever path you choose in life, always remember that the people who love and care about you most are always so very proud of you. Ah, oh, what a pretty card as well. To Charlotte, I feel so lucky to have a daughter as special as you. Happy birthday with love. Have a great day. All I love from mum and dad. Aww, thanks mum and dad. Miss you too. And one more. Can't get them in my Chill out. <laughs> Chill out. <laughs> you can keep that one up all year round. <laughs> yeah. She might be to chill out sometimes. <laughs> Charlotte, I'll oh, chill out and have a cool birthday. Is what it is. It's not just telling me to chill out. <laughs> and have a cool birthday. Whatever the weather. Oh, she knows. Whatever the weather, have a grand birthday. Love from us all. Shirley, Mike, Claire and Lewis, Karen, Chris and Josh. Brett and Maya. Thank you. If you watch this, I don't know if you do, but thank you. <laughs> it's going to be me today. Cocktail in my hand later. Put Potentially. Probably like floating about in the sea on a bit of ice. <laughs> Hopefully not floating about in the sea on a bit of ice. <laughs> That's the context to that card. I meant the drinking a cocktail. Right. So this is mum and dad's present, in fact both of these two are. I think... Yeah, you've got nothing to open from me until... Yeah, no, I have no presents from Carl this morning. I have to wait for those, or... In fact, well, the day is my present, isn't it? Yeah. So... But it all makes sense later. Oh. So this is from mum and dad, and I think this is, um, a foot spa, maybe?
or just a brown box. <laughs> Mm. Oh, I think I need some scissors. Mm. I was right. It is a foot spa. It's not just any foot spa though, it's a deluxe foot spa. Oh wow. It's got rollers in it and everything. So for all my tropic loving subscribers, which I think is most of you, <laughs> um, yeah, I asked for a foot spa because I want to use the Walk on the Beach collection with a with a foot spa. So guess what I'll be doing? Maybe not today because we're off out, but at some point over Christmas, this tar targeted reflexology massage, vibration massage. Hydrotherapy jets, aromatherapy diffuser, water heater, infrared LEDs, and a handy carry handle. Oh, I'm excited to use that. And then, second one from mum and dad. From the white company. It says the little white company on it though, on the bag, and that's the baby stuff. And I don't know if mum's just wishful thinking. <laughs> is, mm. <laughs> I'm not pregnant. <laughs> Sorry, mum. Oh, I don't know if it's just the bag that they've put it in. Maybe they run out of normal bags. No, the box is a normal. It's a normal white company box. These kind of boxes always make me excited. What do you think of it? I don't know. Candles? Maybe? It's a big candle. White company do quite big. Oh, it's not heavy enough for no. a candle. I don't know. No. Do you know? No. <gasps> I think it's a pair of slippers. I know it's cheating once I've opened it, but I can't see them, but. Oh, it's, oh wow. Oh, they're kind of like my Ugg ones, but my Ugg ones, I don't know if you can see, are a bit worn out. As comfy as they still are. Oh, nice. oh I've got some white company. Oh, she knows me well. They go with the house because yeah. they're grey. <laughs> Thanks, Mum and Dad. But look, Dad, I got slippers from you. <laughs> and a foot spa, so thank you. <laughs> oh, they're lovely. Really nice oh, and nice. soft inside. They look really nice, don't they? Aww. Thank you! My bit of health for the day. The crumpets. And my birthday advent calendar. I'm gonna have it for breakfast because why not? Got to look into it. Because you can side eye it. No, I can't. I can't see it. You can look, side eye that. Look, I can't see. My eyes are completely covered. Okay. You recorded, aren't you? Right? Yeah, I yeah. am. So, I'm not controlling, I promise. <laughs> so, do you want to turn the music off Stop. a sec? Sorry, sorry. <laughs> so we're in the car and um, we've had to stop at the post office before we go anywhere quickly. Just to send my last uh, couple of Christmas cards and Carl is now putting the first coat into the sat nav which is why I am like this and he's getting very protective over me looking um, I still don't know where I'm going obviously he keeps trying to throw me off with saying we're in the car for three and a half hours N E. <laughs> and yeah I'm I, I don't know where we're going and yesterday threw a bit of a curveball into the situation because obviously the tier systems quite a lot of the places down south change tomorrow um, so I frantically phoned Carl while I was at work saying um, does this affect our plans because a lot of counties down south are going into tier 3 so Berkshire, Buckinghamshire uh, Hertfordshire, so many places. So I was thinking, oh, it's bound to. Obviously, London is. Um, so I thought it was bound to affect what we're doing. But he 
has assured me obviously it's not affected it because we're staying overnight tonight and we wouldn't be allowed to do that if the place is in tier three so um or if it was going to go into tier three tomorrow so i don't know it narrows it down quite a lot but my geography is not good enough to know what counties are left and where is left so we shall see are you done yeah yeah can i look yeah Oh, and he's put the radio on, so I can't even see. <laughs> I can't even see the route. So, let's go. How long is it going to take us? Two and a half hours. Two and a half hours now, so we've literally not gone anywhere and it's dropped by an hour. <laughs> I mean, three and a half hours. <laughs> we'll probably be there in half an hour. We're just going into we'll Reading. Go Reading. Yeah. Let's go to the Oracle for the day. You'd love that. <laughs> So Kyle just made an oopsie. So on his dashboard, like by a steering wheel, he I could see the time that we're gonna get there and it said 12.45 and it's now 11.34. So about an hour and 10 minutes or from now. One day, one hour and 10 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I don't have my passport, so we're definitely not going abroad. Um, yeah, so we're gonna get there at 12.45, so about an hour and 10 minutes from now we'll be there. And we've just got to a big roundabout near Reading, which is literally like 10 minutes from our house. Um, and we've gone left on the roundabout towards South Wales. That's no, towards London, this way. They said South Wales. So, oh, this is the way that we would go to my parents. We go to see my parents, because <laughs> they live in South Wales. So we're either going to Cardiff is too far. It would take us longer than an hour and ten minutes to get to Cardiff. So we're not we're going. We're going to go to Wales as well. <gasps> I'm joking, Cheryl. <laughs> Mum, Mum's not going to be happy. <laughs> Mum's going to be giving this video a thumbs down now. <laughs> we might have been there last time. <laughs> it might have been. Um, so can I guess where I think we're going? What and you want me to tell you all? Well, it's up to you. So obviously, when they announced the different tiers yesterday, like I said, most places are, are out because they're going to be in tier three tomorrow. But Bristol was one that was, I think, being relaxed. Even I think they might be going from like tier three to tier two. I think they might be in tier two. I'm not too sure, but they're, they're not in tier three originally. Yeah, so that's been eased. So Bristol, but I don't think it's Bristol because we've never mentioned going to Bristol before. Well, I don't really know anything significant in Bristol that might. However, there is somewhere that direction that we have spoken about visiting before. Are we going to Bath? Yes. <laughs> We're going to Bath! <laughs> You said your geography were crap. Well, I know where Bath is, and I know it's towards South Wales from our direction. Yes. And I know that I, like Bath isn't going into Tier 3, because what county is Bath in? Somerset. Somerset, and they weren't mentioned yesterday, so they're not going into Tier 3. I think that sort of area is still like Tier 2, isn't it? So, so yeah. I kind of had an inkling we might be going to Bath and now we're see where we're going and it's probably about an hour and 15 from us so we're off to Bath because we have mentioned it before that I've wanted to go there for a little while just for a day out or or something so we're off to Bath <laughs> for the birthday <laughs> what are we doing in Bath? Uh, you don't have to tell me now I'll tell you <laughs> No, we stayed in Bath. I'll, <laughs> I'll stop asking questions. <laughs> we'll just be and just wait an hour and five hour minutes and now. Hour and five. It's cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can spend the night underneath the mistletoe, and I've gotten you a present that I put under the tree. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for you. Our hotel. It looks really nice.
He's even picked a car park that's named after me. Did you do this special? Obviously. <laughs> We've arrived. We're all checked in. We got here early, but we managed to check in early and this is our room. We've already dumped our coats and our bags, but um, the street is just there. And then this is our room. It's pretty cool. Oh, there's a bit of art, I've only just noticed, right above our bed. If we uh, can't get to sleep tonight, then uh, we've got that to look at. Yeah, it's really quirky. I love the black and white stripes. And then, nice gold mirror. Hi. Really nice dressing table. Another gold mirror, little TV. Mm -hmm. And the bathroom, I think the bathroom's my favourite bit. The black and white stripes continue. And the bathroom, the shower's pretty cool too. Yeah, nice. Like it. Oh, and it's not Tropic, but they have the White Company products in their bathroom. That's pretty snazzy. One better would of course be Tropic, but White Company, I'm not gonna whinge at. But I have obviously brought my own Tropic stuff with me. <laughs> nice, isn't it? Mm. You like it? Yep. Mm. Happy with it. Yeah, really good. You did good. Thanks. Mm. So our dinner isn't until later and it is, what time is it? An hour. Okay. Yeah. Half one. Okay. So we're going to go out and get a little bite to eat, aren't we? We're eating a bit yeah. earlier, aren't we? Well, yeah, it's long time really for getting. Yeah. So we're eating a bit earlier, so we've got to be there at quarter to five. Um, so we're not going to have lunch as such, but we're going to go out. You want a coffee, don't you? Yeah. And I wouldn't mind a hot chocolate or something. So we're going to go and see what we can find in Bath. I'm sure there'll be some nice cafes. Yeah. And then we'll come back and get ready for dinner. As he has told me, shall I tell them now? Yeah, you can he has told me where we're going for dinner. We are going to the Ivy in Bath. I have been to an Ivy before. Only once I went to the Ivy on the King's Road in London with my friend Lauren. This is a couple of years ago now. Carl's never been to an Ivy. Um, and I've already checked out their pictures and what display they have outside their door because mm. obviously the Ivy are known for their really nice displays, like usually floral in the summer and the Christmas displays in the winter. The King's Road has got to be the best because it's probably the biggest Ivy. But um, yeah, I'm excited for that. Um, so we're gonna have a couple of drinks and dinner later um, and get dressed up for it. So yeah, I'm really excited for dinner tonight at the Ivy. But yeah, let's go get a little bite to eat now to keep mm -hmm. us tied over till, till five. The snow is falling down and the storm is on its way. But as long as you're around, everything will be okay. Cause all I wanna do is spend this holiday with you Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you I longed for this moment to have you for myself In a cabin out of nowhere Just got back to the hotel room, Carl's just popped off cause he left my birthday card in the car uh, So he's gone off to get that and just after he left, had a little knock on the door and because when we were at reception, the lady was, um, she was like, oh, is there a special occasion that you've come to visit Bath? Um, and Carl was like, oh, it's her birthday. And look what's just come to the door. Look, how cute. It says, oh, let me take the lid off so you can see it better. It says, happy birthday. Oh, and these are my favourite. I love macarons. So, do I eat it before Carl comes back or do I wait? That is the question. <laughs> no, I will save it so he can get to see it first. And then he can have the strawberries and I will have the macaron. <laughs> I'm 
me Isn't it my birthday yet? Cause I gotta say You're looking like a gift for me Wrapped up nice and neat, baby Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy So all ready to go out for dinner Got my cosy warm coat on Um <laughs> I don't know if you can tell, but my nose is a bit red. I've just done all my on. I've just done all my makeup, and um, I've had a bit of a cry because come here. God, I just had my nose. <laughs> I keep crying every time I think of that. Oh, oh gosh. Oh God, I can't believe it. Can you see? Oh, you can't really see properly. It is perfect. Oh. And I said yes, by the way. Thank God. I think, did I? <laughs> no, you didn't. You asked me to repeat the question. Oh yeah. I said, can you say it again? And then you asked if my best present. Oh, I'm still shaking. <laughs> oh dear. Oh yeah, but we're gonna go out for dinner and um, I'll calm down a little bit and then get fresh air, mate. Yeah, yeah, I might come back on and talk to you guys later. But bye. <laughs> So actually, having a picture on your ceiling, we were just saying it's oddly satisfying, weren't yeah. we? It's quite nice. Yeah. It's not a bad idea. It'd be nice if they had a few more, actually. <laughs> yeah. We're just waiting for our film to come on, the telly, and we just find ourselves looking at the picture on the ceiling. Maybe it's staring at the ceiling. <laughs> Morning, fiance. Morning. It's still here. It wasn't a dream. <laughs> we've got afternoon tea today, haven't we? Mm -hmm. So we're yeah. having a lazy morning and then we're going to go, what's it called? The pump room. The pump room, yeah. Pump room in Bath and have our afternoon tea. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. I'm going to get so annoying doing this all the time. Don't say me too close. <laughs> all ready to go for afternoon tea. Although it's a bit early, we're going to go and have a walk around the shops first, aren't we? Yeah. yeah. What are you doing? Just checking out this is Marmot to the wall. Why? She's messy job. Was oh, it? <laughs> Checking out the hotel's DIY. <laughs> Does anybody else's boyfriend do that? <laughs> oh, fiance. <laughs> oh, that's, sorry, that's sorry. But yeah, so we're just gonna go for afternoon tea. And I'm oh, sorry, I was just <laughs> checking out my ring in the oh, mirror just before I was like, oh, it just looks so nice with this outfit. And I was like, I think it's. I'm gonna be saying that to everything. But I just can't get over it. First morning. If you've been engaged yourself, I'm sure you will understand how I feel. And if you haven't, then it'll happen one day and it's worth the wait. Um, I'm 33 now, so I've waited a long time. <laughs> 
but my time is finally here, so I'm gonna milk it. <laughs> you could be one of the things I love. Sunday morning breakfast with my bedroom door locked. They're like everything that has a cherry on top. Get on my list of the things I love, love, love. You could be the one I trust. All the second chances say I'm nothing for us. and not necessarily filmed as much as I was going to for my birthday video so this has now turned into a birthday slash engaged <laughs> video but I hope you've enjoyed it nonetheless and um, yeah I've enjoyed seeing the excitement that we are experiencing at the moment and of course I will bring you along for the ride with when the wedding plans Start. I can't believe I'm saying that. That sounds so crazy. I didn't think I'd ever say that to be honest But yeah, I'll bring you along when that starts. Obviously, it's not gonna be until the new year at least so first, first of January, no When year. I say at least yes um, first of January <laughs> But yeah, I'm sure I will do videos um, to update you with um, what we're doing what's happening um, because obviously this COVID situation is not disappearing yet. So we'll have to keep an eye on that as well. So, um, but yes, I'm very excited to start that, even if we just go and look at venues and things like that um, and get a bit of an idea of what we want. So mm, exciting stuff. Um, I hope you all have a lovely Christmas. I probably will, well, obviously this video is going up, but I'm going to try and get another one up before Christmas day. Um, oh, blinded by the sun wait for us to get around this corner <laughs> um, yeah I hope we, you all have a lovely Christmas um, but yeah like I said I'm gonna try and get another one up before then um, but if I don't have a lovely Christmas have a lovely week leading up to it because I'm sure most of you are maybe broken up by now for Christmas or the kids are and stuff um, so yeah have a lovely weekend and I'll chat to you soon bye fiance say bye See ya. <laughs>